this is Linda Jennings and this is Backyard Biodiversity. So here's a beautiful understory tree that I would love you to learn. And so this is Acer circinatum or vine maple. And so this grows in the understory in our conifer forest and it's kind of got these thin branches. And so what starts to happen is it grows upwards towards the light. It actually just starts to bend over. And so it actually vines, which is why it's actually known as vine maple. And as you get a little bit of a closer look, at the end of August, it's setting its seed now, right? So these are winged fruits, right? So it's got two seeds right here, two seeds, and they're winged, right? So as I clip this guy off here, so this is a nice winged fruit, and there's going to be two seedlings there that are going to take off once it starts to dry. It's a little wet still, so it's not quite dry enough and lightweight enough to get away from its parent. But the whole idea is that it's just going to take off. Let's see. Ah! couldn't quite do it but if you play with these basically they basically spin really really well and they just shoot off like a helicopter right so those are Samaras and that's really distinctive in the Acer family or the maple family right you're also going to be able to tell a little bit by its leaf it's got a smaller leaf we have a very iconic tree called big leaf maple which is gigantic leaf where this one's much smaller so basically it's about the size of my hand there Let's see if we can do that with one hand. Da, 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 da. Yes, we can. So there is that nice, nice small leaf there compared to our big leaf maple. So that's a little bit of a distinguishing feature as well, is these nice, beautiful fruits that you're going to be seeing around in the forest now. And you can play with and you can fling around and see how far you can get them at distance. So that wonderful helicopter. Whew, fly away and the whole point is that it wants to get away from its parent so when it gets to its reproductive stage it doesn't actually end up back crossing with its parent so it's just trying to fly away as far as it can so again i want you to know this plant it's a great beautiful tree again vining in our understory in our pacific northwest forest and it's known as vine maple or acer circinatum